Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. I'm outside with Ellie Belly. We are headed out. We're just waiting for Sam. He literally, went, oh, Ellie, come here. Ellie, come here. Good girl. A good little dog. Oh, our grass needs to be cut. You're disgusting. Let's pick some grass later and give it to the chickens. All right, so we got some boxes and we're going somewhere. We're leaving Gabby at home. So Gabby's staying home because she's working with her math tutor, doing math. You guys saw yesterday that we were looking for two chickens, the very specific ones. We want white silkies. And we had such a, we're having such a hard time finding them. Like you can't find chickens. Last year, everybody was selling chickens. Every single one of my friends that does chickens was hatching eggs and, and selling chickens, baby chicks. And this year, nobody that I know has baby chicks except for us. And we have a lot of them. All of our silky babies are hatching. I'm super excited, but we luckily, Sam found two white silkies today just for us. Another thing that is so super crazy is that chickens are going for, just like puppies were a few years ago, so much money. Like it's costing, I see like one chicken $60, one chicken $70 for, for like silkies and for, all different breeds like chickens are going for so much money they're cheaper if you buy them when they're babies especially if you buy straight run because then you don't know if you're getting a rooster or a hen but literally they're so expensive it's insane chickens are turning into gold you guys and just like that we got silky chickens um one thing i don't love about them is that they go broody so fast but look at how cute she is so this is mine this is the one sophie gave to me See how they have blue ears? Do you guys see the ears? They're blue. Mine's, mine is Lily. Okay. And they have five toes. Let's see yours. Ellie's like, I will have it. <laughs> so cute. I literally love them. These are what we have in the incubator right now. I don't want to be done. She is so cute. One is tiny. And one is big. Sam, you just picked something out of the garbage. Yeah, what is you throwing out? It's something that I didn't want anymore. It's called garbage. Yeah, throwing out my stuff. It's my stuff. How do you know it's your stuff? It's because it was in my barn bucket. Oh, behave. Okay, so here they are. There's Ellie. <laughs> she wants to eat them. Okay, let's look at them. Oh, she needs her nails cut. Oh my goodness, we should cut their nails. What? What? Two of our baby chickens hats. See, look, the puff is white. So, yeah, they're gray though. Like, it's hard to tell because their skin is black and their bones are black, so it's hard to tell when they're wet what color they're gonna be. That oh, that one's really cute. So, two have hatched, another two are trying. There's more than two. Yeah, they're all starting to hatch today. So you're probably wondering why we bought two um, silky chickens when we have a bunch of chicks that we're, that we're raising. First, we wanted white, and we don't know if we're gonna get white in this, in this clutch. We also want black, and we don't know if we're gonna get black in this clutch, but um, we're hoping, uh, we wanted adult chickens, not just babies. And most of Sophie's babies we sell. But if there are like a couple of interesting ones that are nice colors and stuff, we'll definitely keep them. I don't know what color that, that looks like. If it's going to be like partridge. It's so cute though. Or if it's going to be like a gray, like a splash. I feel like horses are our life, our passion, and chickens are our hobby. Chickens are like a collectible kind of like for us. We love seeing all the different colors and all the different color eggs and stuff. So it's just like a hobby, something that we like to do together. And then horses are our passion. This is the best toy for Ellie. Yeah, let's show them. It's cause it's small enough and it's like easy to squeak. And she loves it. I made another brooder. We have like so many boxes. We have so many boxes. We have so many boxes of chickens. I can't wait till they all grow up and then they all go to their new home. But right now, right now we're just enjoying them. This doesn't seem like it's much room for them, but they actually go underneath this. This is like all this space. So it's all from like here back for the tiniest baby chicken. Tonight, Sophie plans to prank all the people at the barn. Yeah. But basically, she put, here, look over this way a bit more so that it's not, you're not in the sun. No, 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 put your face over. So basically, she did her makeup so that it looks like she has a black eye. I didn't eye. do that good this time. 
I think it looks really good. She's going to tell them that she fell off in her last lesson. You're going to tell them. Cause I'm, I'm going to tell them that in her Western lesson, she fell off. Should we say you fell off or should we say you got kicked? Fell off and hit your head. Well, that's where she always hits. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hit my head, yes. Eyes, huh? Well, I hit my head off. She got a black eye last time she fell on her head. Yeah, Dad. Sam doesn't think that falling off and getting a black eye is believable. Well, I got a black eye last time. put some on your face, though, too, because you would have had a scratch on your face. Last time your eye was full and shut. Anyway, we're going to prank Brandon and Barn Boots when we go to the barn tonight and see if they believe us. Yeah, hopefully they do. Hopefully they do. Hi. This is what we do to Ellie. Oh, no, don't, don't do that. Remember Daisy used to do that after a little bit? And yeah, Chino does bed. that too. Oh yeah, Chino definitely does. <laughs> oh, hello, Mr. Magoo. <laughs> How are you? Are they being nice to you now? We've been watching on the camera. Oh yeah, Chino and his bay sidekick. Do you think it's that he likes little girls or do you think that it's that he likes bays? It's actually not too cold out today. Like it's still cool, it's still wintry. Yeah, I know, we know, that's your girlfriend. He's flanked by, flanked by beauties. Over there we got that one. It might not look like it, but I'm getting there, you guys. I think I'm gonna sell this. We bought it at a yard sale. I tried washing it and it's still dirty. But it's like a non-slip pad, but it pulls their hair. It's not super nice. Also, we have our, I washed our, our bags. You know, what are they called? That you put on your Western thing? And one of them is mine, so I'm going to pick one. This one will be mine, and I'm going to put it in my bucket, my empty bucket. I'm so proud to have a bucket, though, and have, like, my own stuff. And then I'll probably end up putting one in Sophie's thing. Because Gabby doesn't use them. So I'm still sorting stuff in the middle of the floor here. I should actually take all of our polar wraps and, and wash them. But here's my question. We got these boxes long ago. They had coffee cups in them. And I kept the boxes because it reminded me of Stella and Storm. And I love the pictures on here. And I love the boxes. They're dusty, but they're easy to clean. They're still clean on the inside. They're just dusty on the outside. You guys think I should keep them or toss them? I'm having a hard time with this one. I don't want to toss them because they mean so much to me. They remind me of our beloved horses, our beloved first horses. Would you toss them or would you keep them? Comment below. I also washed this blanket. It's um, one of those blankets that's rubber on one side so you can use it like as a picnic blanket or whatever and then soft and warm on the other side. We use them in the arena. I washed that. It's actually supposed to be summer again this weekend. I'm excited because we have big plans. I have plans that I have like to get ready for. It's, it's, it's a lot of work, this, these plans. It's going to be a lot of work, but it's going to be a happy time. One of my next jobs is to clean this thing up because we have so much stuff on here and I want it to just be more organized. Remember we bought this bucket for a reason that's coming soon to a video near you. And then I have like all the stuff that we use for cleaning, all the stuff that we use for like rain raw, all the stuff that we use for fly spray to make our own. I have like supplements back here, all of these supplements that we use. That's, that's, I used this on Penny the other day when she got cold. I was worried that maybe she wasn't drinking as well because it, the weather, t the temperature changed so drastically she was drinking she was peeing fine but i just wanted to double check and make sure so i gave her that and our anti-flam and our oil this is we actually use the w3 or the w5 i forget what it's called oil for mad barn but it comes in like a little pouch or at least it did the last time we bought it so i use this container and dump it in anyway we are headed to the barn now to the barn to see our friends, to ride horses. I have Crocs on them. I'm not sure if it's like something I love, <laughs> but I'm doing it anyway. I'm like, wait, 
Chino's door is open. I just want to check on Penny again, make sure she's good. I'm not shaking. She's like, I just needed my warm blanket. Yeah, she looks a lot better now. Just messy because you're always rolling. All right, we'll be back. I'll check on you when we get home. That's it. I got nothing for you. I'm sorry. All right, let's go. We'll be back. We always come down later, especially when they go. We always come down later and give them more food. We, like you guys know, we divide the food into small portions and they get fed three times during the day and then we come back at like around 10. No. We come back around 10 and feed them again before we go to bed. Her. Let's be real. Sam does that. I told Alyssa's mom was like, oh no, what happened? And I told her that it was makeup, but. All right, so are we pranking Brandon? Sure. Timba is the sweetest little pony. I know, so every time we come here, Come on, let's go. Every time we show up, um, the all the ponies in the one field they come running as soon as they see her car because they think we're gonna give them treats. That's how that's how much horses know us. Sophie's in love with this little mini. She loves him. He's like four years old. Hi. He's so cute. He's on the corner and I'm like, oh, what happened? And it's all fake. <laughs> we're gonna prank <laughs> Brandon. <laughs> <laughs> it is for Kate, but Brandon. <laughs> oh, we don't care. Wow, that is what you call a feed pan. Is this what all the horses here get? Yep. Wow, that's that's awesome. What's that stuff on top? The flaxseed and salt. Flaxseed and salt, and I saw you put oil in there. Yep. Should we be giving our horses flaxseed? Ours get salt already, but we give them oil. But what's the flaxseed for? Help make it shiny. Oh, ours, ours get shiny, but oh, that's cool. Stay here. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> you got Sophie, you're taller than Elizabeth now, I think. Are you? Stand, no. I think so. Stand back to back. Oh, uh, barely, but yeah. Wow. So uh. Stop! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> what? Every, like, no, 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 I don't, I don't even think that's the case. I think they're just not saying. <laughs> oh yeah, did you guys know she fell on her last lesson? She's like literally, Sophie's like the faller. Yeah, she fell, going like so slow. Is your video? Not I cut it out of the video. Oh. <laughs> Nobody likes to see her fall, but yeah, she fell. What? Yeah, going slow at the very end of the lesson, literally going so slow. I also fell off the stairs today. Yeah. It's like you should be my child. <laughs> <laughs> Did you notice it? Yeah, she asked when. Did you, you tell her what happened? Yeah, I did. Yeah. It was a prank. <laughs> She wanted to prank you guys. No way. So we tried to prank Brandon and we said Elizabeth almost gave it a wager. Oh my gosh. It's her genetic. It's genetic. So I thought it was real for a second, but then I was like, no, I would have noticed something. Okay, so listen. We we were gonna prank Brandon and we told Elizabeth's mom not to tell and she, she she told them <laughs> because she didn't realize. She thought we were just pranking you guys. No, so she said it. And then in front of Scott and Julia, she starts saying it again. <laughs> like, Shh. She said, did it work? Yeah, did it work? <laughs> Worked for me. <laughs> I didn't think it was real because only because you were, you were texting me. I know. Julia was looking at it and looking at it and looking at it. <laughs> <laughs> We're not a prank family. We just can't. We just yeah, can't. Okay. Well, I'm certain Let me get a thumbnail. Sophie, Julia, look at her and go. Wait. <laughs> Wait. I missed it. Okay, do it again. <laughs> we got Lily today. We got Nash. And we got Watcha. Don't you know the